Hi, this is Phil Cook with a quick tip for pastors and ministry leaders about the power of small books. I often call them mini books because very often they could be compiled from a sermon series, maybe five, six, seven episodes of a sermon series. You could take those transcripts and edit them into a, a small book. Now, let me tell you why they, they matter so much. First of all, uh, you have a book. I know so many pastors who spend their lives creating content, creating great sermon and teaching material, never have a book to show for it. You can have a book remarkably easy and remarkably cheaply these days. The second thing is they're powerful fundraising tools. I've seen capital campaigns. I've seen all kinds of fundraising efforts for great causes. All began with offering a small book. Now, this is called Kingdom Come by Jimmy Witcher, pastor in, in Texas, who's done a great job. He understands the power of doing this. And you can use them in so many ways. You can carry them with you to, to conferences and events. They're easy and cheap to ship because they're so small. And many of them are even smaller than this. So think about the power of small books. If you've never done a book before, reach out to us. My blog is philcook.com, P-H-I-L-C-O-O-K-E. Or you can, in, you can email us at info, I-N-F-O, info at cookmediagroup.com. Those are ways that we can get information to you about how to get a small book like this done because it can make a real difference in getting your message out there to the world. Don't feel like you need a big publisher. Don't feel like you need a lot of money. It's amazing how easy these days it is to get a great book out there based on just a sermon series or a teaching or a vision or a purpose you have in your life. It can be so important. Small books, mini books, whatever you want to call them, they can be powerful tools.